Welcome back everyone. We're going to play Dying Light again. In the last episode we play we started the new game. Yeah, I think it was halfway through the introduction of the new game. And uh yeah, well let's continue now. Alright, let's go. We continued now and uh let's jump down. I don't know if it was meant to uh <sighs> be like that or that we just found out something but i think it's a fast way to continue and get down actually gravity is one of the fast things ah biters i thought there was another bite here Ooh. Ooh. That's also helpful. Oh! There was the last one. I knew there was one left. But are we able to go inside? Mm. Alright, for everyone. Uh, there's a lot to uh, discover inside there. So uh, I would uh, suggest you also go inside and check it out. Okay, uh, do we have to walk around here? Yes, we can. When I played this, yeah, well, last weekend, I found out that you can uh, also go through the water there. Alright, this is a room full of sleeping beauties, is what they are called. So I'm going to uh, go slowly through here. But we got through there. Nice. Nice and easy. We have to do it like this. Climb on this ladder and jump for the other to the other. The looks of this game are really incredible. Hey, not a bi. Alright, that was easy. A little tap on the R1 button. Button. Okay, just take the zip line. You don't need to hold R1 or something. Ah, nice. My favorite part. Right, that one's dead. Oh, it's getting dark. We need to move quickly. Whoa. It's just getting darker by almost counting down so fast it will is happening or going. Ah! We got our first uh, skill point for the parkour points. Uh, you've leveled up your parkour proficiency and earned your first parkour skill point. You can now use it to unlock your first parkour skill. Alright. We only have one option. The high jump. Ah! Hold. Nice, nice. Okay. So now we can jump to this ladder. Almost there. Oh, it's already dark. It's time to hide somewhere for the night. It won't get any better than this. The broadcast station should be here somewhere. Ooh. Someone moved them. Not long ago. It's been moved. Okay, let's give it a try. Right. Push, 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 push. So we're already inside. 
Nighttime is my least favorite part in the game. Well, this is it. The broadcast station. I gotta start the generator. I wanted to ask the same thing. Is that uh, the one of those banshee uh, zombies? It looks like it. Ah, yeah. Some enemies use power attacks that deal massive damage and can knock you down. When an enemy is about to use power, a power attack, his health bar starts blinking red. Dodge to avoid being hit. To perform a dodge, press R1 while moving back or to a side. Alright, seems pretty straightforward. Let's see. Oh damn! Come on, Benji. Let's focus on the bench. Yeah. Oh, nice, we got it. Alright, now the last two. Hey, that was close. Oh, Mr. Generator. Wait until the morning. I wasn't planning on going out anyway, so yeah. Alright. You've just unlocked your fir the first safe zone, increasing your network of uh, respawn points. All safe zones are equipped with UV light which guarantees safe safety at night. Additionally, each safe zone offers access to a resting place, a bed, where you can change the day-night phase, and Aiden's stash, where you can leave your access items. Seems all pretty straightforward, but let's skip to the day. Have you brought 12346? We were supposed to take the patients back to the city. Don't worry, they'll let us go soon. I'm scared. I'm here with you. You're safe with me. I know. Do what I tell you. You 
easy. Ceases. Even if they separate us, this is how we'll always find each other. will be here any moment. Wait. Close your eyes. Time to contact the guy Spike was talking about. Alright, I don't know if you can get actually wrong with this, but I know he said this thing. 140.200 megahertz. Megahertz. Whoa. Okay, let's see. This is Aiden. I'm on frequency 140.200 megahertz. Hello? Aiden? It, yes. I was supposed to get in touch with you. I thought you changed your mind. Why are you looking for Waltz, Pilgrim? To find someone else. Her name is Mia. Fifteen years ago, we were in a hospital together and... I know who you're looking for, Aiden. You want to know why Waltz was doing those experiments on all of you. Why you are stronger, more durable than others. Now, I just want to find Mia. I've been looking for her since I left the survivor's camp. I... Can you help me or not? Maybe I can. Let's meet, Pilgrim. Where and when? Entrance to the metro tunnel by the bay. You can get inside the tunnels through an open GRE hatch. I'll meet you there. I take it you're not doing this for free. I have to leave the city, but I won't make it on my own outside. Take me to New Paris, and we're even. Along the way, I'll tell you everything I know. Over and out. Wait. I have to at least know if she's alive. She's alive. I'm going to the rendezvous. I'll see you later, Rita. Alright, but we will, uh continue this mission the pilgrim's path in the next episode because i want to keep the episodes i want to keep them around 15 minutes that's a nice time and uh, all right if you enjoyed this video please uh, consider subscribing leave a like also join my streams on wednesdays i will probably stream dying light anyways and uh yeah i'll see you all next time bye bye